Hi, this is Noel Serrano with the Gala Lighthouse. You are a child of God. Brought into his family by the power and grace of Jesus' sacrifice for you. As believers, we hear we are God's children. But often we don't live our lives in response to that truth and instead live out of the mindset of an orphan. Children don't worry when they have a good father. They don't wonder if they'll be able to eat, if they're loved, or if they have a place in this world. The unconditional love of a parent lays a foundation for them to have secure peace and joy. Your God desires the same for you. God wants to lay an unshakable foundation for you based solely on His love for you as His child, so that when the storms come and waves crash over you, you remain strong in your identity. First, let's look at what Scripture says about you and then take some time to respond to God's word and faith. John 1, 12, 13 says, But to all who did receive him, who believed in his name, he gave the right to become children of God, who were born not of blood, nor of the will of the flesh, nor of the will of man, but of God. Galatians 4, 6, 7 says, and because you are sons, God has sent the Spirit of His Son into our hearts, crying, Abba, Father. So you're no longer a slave, but a son. And if a son, then an heir through God. Finally, 2 Corinthians 6.18 says, And I will be a father to you you shall be sons and daughters to me, says the Lord Almighty. Through adoption into God's family, you are now a co-heir with Christ. Romans 8.17 says that we are God's children. And if children, then heirs. Heirs of God and fellow heirs with Christ. You were born again into God's family when you asked Jesus to be your Lord and Savior. So what does it mean to be God's child? What does it mean to be a co-heir with Christ? It means that all that is God's is yours. He shares with you his kingdom. You have a father who gives you amazing gifts. You have a father who absolutely loves spending time with you. Your heavenly dad's love for you knows no bounds. His love is pervasive, powerful, and freely given. You no longer need to worry about whether you have a place in this world. There is no need to concern yourself with whether you will have clothes or food. You no longer have to live in pursuit of the opinions of those around you. God enjoys you. He has a plan for you. He doesn't take being your father lightly. He takes complete ownership of his responsibility. He will strengthen you, teach you, develop you, and give you a life of passion and meaning. To be the child of God is to be loved, liked, and completely cared for. 
So how can you live in response to God's word? How can you get out of the mindset of an orphan? You must have faith that God is who he says he is and believe he will do what he's promised to do. Romans 10:17 says faith comes from hearing and hearing through the word of Christ. You have heard the word of the Lord today. You are his child. He promises to provide for you. So have faith. Faith isn't something you just conjured up. It's a response to God's faithfulness. God has and will be faithful to you. Allow his word to stir up faith within you today. Live in response to his promises. And allow the peace and joy of being God's child to lay an unshakable foundation for you today. God bless you. This is Noel Serrano with the Gala Lighthouse, and the following has been a presentation of the Gala Foundation.